Hello, hello, hello. Thanks for stopping by. Dr. Bad Vibes here. We've got some silly news. We've got a mother <laughs> accused of threatening kids and running over a kid with her truck over bullying. Let's see exactly what happened. So a mother ran over a girl and threatened children at a park for bullying on Tuesday. According to court documents, a 30-year-old drove to the park around 4 p.m. in her white Chevy Silverado and walked over to a group of kids and started shouting and started a shouting match between them. So police said that she grabbed a 14-year-old boy by the hair and pulled his head back and forth and side to side while yelling at him. Court paperwork said that she then grabbed a sharp stick from her truck and ran after the boy yelling, I'm going to kill you and run you over. That sounds redundant and overdoing it a bit, but all right. So she got to her silver auto with her four kids inside and sped toward 15 kids standing in the park. She went through the park's rock landscape and ran over a 12-year-old girl's ankle. So she allegedly kept driving through the park as kids ran for their lives. She then went back to the parking lot and sped off on 87th Avenue. She was caught on cell phone camera and they tracked her down the home. So anyways, during an interview with the detective, she said it started because she saw preteens throwing wood chips at three of her kids and believed one of them punched her 10-year-old daughter. She said she confronted them and they called her a bitch. So she grabbed one boy and told him not to call her that, court record state it said. She admitted to get a stick and walking towards another boy who, all, who called her a fat bitch, but claimed that she never threatened him, according to court paperwork. So she said the second boy followed her to her truck and started dancing behind it. She claimed she yelled at him to move, so he did. And police said she admitted to putting the, put, putting the truck aggressively into reverse and then into drive before driving through the park. She said she didn't believe she ran over the girl, but later said, I hope I didn't. And she said her children were being bullied by the group of kids and reported it to the police in school but nothing was done she said she thought her four children had seat belts on they told police they were bouncing all over the place while she drove through the park so yeah she was booked into jail on six counts of endangerment four counts of aggravated assault two counts of aggravated assault with a deadly weapon and one count of attempted first degree murder good lord yeah she messed up she's being held on a two hundred fifty thousand dollar cash bond so yeah i mean like I can understand being upset, seeing your kid getting bullied, or or any kid getting bullied. <laughs> There's a way to handle that. Going after them in a truck is not how you do that. Maybe yelling at, maybe scaring them a little, but you can do it with words. It all happened here at this park near 91st and Olive Avenues. Detectives say that woman threatened to kill a teen boy before driving her car through this park. You can still see some tire marks here in the gravel and on the sidewalk tonight. She went off road. It is recommending a $250,000 cash bond in this case. 30 year old Brandy Gotch making her first appearance in court this morning. The Peoria mom is accused of charging at kids, trying to run them over with her truck on Tuesday. This world is just getting crazier and crazier. Detectives say Gotch <laughs> saw some of the kids throwing wood chips at her children and believed she one of like them a punched her 10 year old daughter. That's Can't when she what allegedly wrong. grabbed a teen boy by the hair and aggressively pulled his head back and forth. Court documents reveal she then got a sharp stick from her car and chased after the boy yelling, I'm going to kill you and run you over. This is a mom trying to protect her child and she's going after another child to do it. That's not showing them the right example as a parent. <laughs> Police say Gotch then got into on, her like, truck with her kids, unbuckled in the back seat, and sped toward a group of more than a dozen children, running over a 12-year-old girl's foot. Multiple other children that were forced to flee to avoid being run over. Police later tracked down Gotch at her home down the street from the park and arrested her. She told detectives Obviously, her children were being bullied by the group of kids bullied. and reported it to the school and to police, but said nothing was done. Prayers go out to the child that was injured and even for the lady who lost it, you know, like my prayers go out to her that she gets the right help she needs and that her child isn't affected negatively by the actions of their parent. And Gotch is facing several charges tonight, including aggravated assault and disorderly conduct with a weapon. As for that little girl who was injured, we're told she only has minor injuries and is expected to be okay. Reporting live in Peoria, Emma Lockhart for Arizona's family. Could have been much worse. Glad that little girl. Bullying's not cool. 
Murder is also not cool. <laughs> it's not really how you solve bullying. Obviously, I would be, I would be raging at those kids as well. But don't, don't use a truck. Don't use a pointed stick. Use your words. You probably still scare them a little if you do it the right way.